uh, to what you told uh, in answer to the questions uh, my colleague, uh, the chair, asked you. You agree with me that, uh, as you have ably said, the history of a man or a woman, the experiences are what mold you, isn't it? And you and I have some common history somewhere. We went to a very good school somewhere. And that has molded us in a sense, isn't it? Absolutely. Yes, the Hill School in Eldoret. So we have a common history there. So uh, you, you talked about your experience in university, uh, which uh, that was in 1982. And I think for Kenyans, uh, that period is very, I mean, it's, it's one of the turbulent times in Kenya um, where many things happened and uh, some of them the well documented, some not so well documented. And then you went to the state law office, correct? Yes. So you were in the state law office until 1992? Am I correct? Yes, you're correct. Okay. So you recall that uh, you prosecuted a case of George Anyona? Yes. Edward Oyugi? Yes. Godo Kariuki? Yes. And Augustus Katangu? Yes. You were the prosecutor? Yes. And maybe I may not get the facts right, but uh, please uh, correct me, because these matters um, appear to have been scrubbed off the internet and other sources. So these men were arrested uh, having certain documents at Mutugi Bar in Dagoreti Corner. Mm -hmm. Am I correct? Those were the facts? Yeah, 11th of July 1990. I don't remember the date, but go ahead. Yes. Uh, and. Uh, they were brought to court uh, and the trial began. They were not given bail, correct? I, yeah, possibly. Possibly. Yes, I'm, I'm waiting for the question. No, no, no. I, I want us to lay the factual basis because... Uh, it's a long uh, time. I wish uh, I had Yes, it's a long time. Have, uh, but as I said, these are pivotal part of our history and I think we must get it right. That's why I'm putting yeah. it to you. Okay. Because you are the prosecutor. So. If you don't know, you don't know, but I'm just putting them on record so that we, we are very clear. So, in um, they were denied bail. They were not given bail for sedition. And uh, they were arrested in July 1990, and the trial began on 10th January 1991. Now, the follow them alleged that they were tortured. Uh, am I correct? I don't recall. You don't recall? Mm -hmm. And then you were the one who prosecuted them, called several witnesses. And you produced a confession. You produced a confession. Is that correct? Uh, I, I, uh, just carry on. Um, no, no, I'm asking whether you uh, just tell me. I want it on record I, that you don't I, remember. I, I, I call eyewitnesses and so on. Yes, and, you and call eyewitnesses. You know, you, as to the specific evidence that was produced, to the detail, I, yes, okay. but uh, there, there was a confession, mm -hmm. uh, a confession, okay? And there was a trial within a trial mm -hmm. before the magistrate, Honorable Francis Mabele. Am I correct? That I, I remember the, the trial magistrate was Mabele? Yes, yes, Mabele. By the way, I was a young boy then. And the issue of torture, they led evidence of torture at the Nyayo House Chambers. Am I correct? I, you don't I, recall? I, yes, these are, what year was it? As in this quite a long time ago. Uh, uh, 1991? Yeah. 1990. Hmm. 1990, I was in Form 4. So, at the Alliance High School. And they led evidence that they were being uh, tortured and you resisted that application, of course, as the prosecutor. And the confession was admitted. Am I correct? Possibly. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting for the question. Thereafter, <laughs> the trial came to an end and they were convicted. I remember they were convicted. How many years were they convicted for? I'm not sure. Okay. Uh, Ten years, nine years, you, you don't remember. No. So the issue I'm asking 
You know, you have told us that in 1982, you were arrested as part of a group of people who were alleged to be coup plotters, people who had taken part in the melee here in Nairobi. Actually, it wasn't plotters. Oh, not it plotters, was, but yes. people who are... Certainly not plotters. Yes. Uh, yeah. the, uh, what I would say, there is the style of the coup, the people who are, you know, swept up in all that melee, whatever it was. That's why you, don't, you need to be specific. Yeah. And that is why I'm saying, mm -hmm. you correct me, because mm -hmm. this is historical. Mm -hmm. I told you I was a still a young boy. Mm -hmm. So you were swept up in that. And, and from your own words, this was a very pivotal part in your experience, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So you were swept up in all this manena of the coup, students, rioting, or whatever. But it was in that, in that melee of the coup, isn't it? Just make your question, please. No, no, no. I, I am mean, putting to you. Part. You know, I, you, are, you are saying things, and some of which are, I don't recall, some of which may not be true, but I prefer you get to No, no, no. So if they are not true, you tell me they are not okay. true, because I wasn't there. Okay. I was, we were not, it wasn't rioting. It wasn't rioting. Yes, certainly. So what were you accused of? Of taking part in a demonstration. Taking part in the demonstration. And this demonstration was in relation to what? the coup it was in relation to the coup yes and you were brought here to the court uh, yes. isn't it yes. of course you were denied bail yes you went through that harrowing experience yes. so that is something that has is imp i mean it was a 